Hey guys and welcome back to another video. So today The Sims 4 has released the Nifty Knitting Stuff Pack trailer, which is the pack that we've been voting for the past year almost, I want to say. This is the second community stuff pack and uh, yeah, let's see what is in store in this trailer. I'm kind of excited, so let's go ahead and do that. This does have The Sims 2 music. I previewed it like at the beginning, but it made me like just so nostalgic because I love The Sims 2. What the? That's a look. <laughs> Why is he on the roof? Can you actually knit while you're on the toilet? Because... I mean, okay. Look at the penguin! <gasps> the toddlers can rock... Buy and sell on Plopsy. This is really cool. I only found out about this like later on, but that makes it so exciting so you can like sell your crafts. Wait, was that Yarny from Unravel? Hold up. We'll do like a little... <gasps> the... Wait, did the panda get voted in? I don't remember that. I don't even remember there being a panda up for vote, was there? I guess there's no date on uh, the video that they sent us, but uh, let me go ahead and check. Okay, so it turns out the pack comes out July 28th, which is in two weeks? Oh my gosh, that's actually so soon, now that I think about it. Oh my god, yeah, that's in exactly two weeks, next Tuesday. All right, so let's see what we have in store here. I'm gonna mute this so that we're not listening to the music again, but uh obviously we have the hair that they did show us maybe a month or so ago of some of the hairs that they're releasing with this pack so i'm kind of excited to see what other things uh i believe this is a shirt that we did vote for i honestly cannot remember the voting's happened so long ago but this looks like something you could put you know on your outerwear let's see okay so this is giving us a whole makeover of basically the stuff that got put in don't remember this i'm not gonna lie i know that there's two knitting baskets that made it in okay yeah it is yarny all right, if you guys don't know, there's a game on Origin called Unravel, and that's it right there. All right, let's see what else do we have. This is a look. You can see this Sim wearing a scarf, so I'm wondering if you can actually craft scarves and have your Sims just wear them. Now, that would be exciting. Like, accessories? I'm looking forward to that. So, this hair is, of course, new as well. Uh, he's just knitting on the toilet. So, we have the planter, the little seat. I love this mailbox. Some of the plushies. Oh, there's a pink swatch of the penguin as well. Let's see what else. See, I, I swear I don't remember this panda even being a thing. We got a car. Wait! We had got ended up getting a rug. I swear none of the rugs made it in. Okay, well, I'm happy about that. And we have Grim, another like basket, Yarny again. I don't know, just seeing this like orientation reminds me of the Brady Bunch. <laughs> but uh, yeah, let's see what else we have. Oh, the panda's a toy. Or maybe it is also a plushie. It might still be a plushie, even though it's doesn't really look like one. It looks more like a, just a toy. This top, I really like it. It would look really nice in like white. She's really pretty too. I love this that they can actually rock on the chairs. That they can make use of it instead of just the um, the adults. And the thing is, like, this is going to make it so nice to decorate uh, nurseries and stuff. I always think to have a rocking chair in the nursery. I don't know if this is the same sweater that the guy wore at the beginning. It might be similar. This is just the most ridiculous outfit. I wonder if this is like, because I'm sure there's going to be a knitting skill. Uh, I wonder if like this is like the beginning part, like this is what it looks like and then you get better and so your stuff looks nicer because this is just the mess, like he just stuck pom-poms on it and everything. Uh, looks like we have yarning or knitting books too. And that- wait! Oh my god, wait, the kids can knit? I just noticed that! Oh my god, look at all this stuff. That is so much. I'm not gonna lie, I'm really loving this like whole pastel vibe. I feel like there is a lot of pastel colors in this game, but I mean, I'm not mad about it. This is kind of cool though. The fact that you can actually sell... Oh, you can even sell sweaters! I didn't even notice that. Socks, hats... Oh, this is so cool. Sold, selling everything. I just like that, that there's gonna be more like activities for them to do. I think we've seen these items already. This dress already kind of looks like something we've had. I know that there's some items that definitely made it in that Kind of looks similar to things that we already have, but what can we do? 
Uh, but the rocking chair I'm super excited for. Uh, and look at the elders out here. This hair reminds me of, if you guys have ever seen that 70s show, uh, Kitty Foreman. I tweeted about it like when they showed this hair for the first time. But yeah, so that is the trailer. So I do have a few screenshots that I can share with you guys. So here's a little closer look at the items in the game. I actually don't, I don't think this is new, right? I don't know if that is. If it is, let me know. But I'm glad that we got a rug. I don't. I honestly don't remember a rug winning. Also, I didn't realize that Grim was gonna be so small. These hats do look like the ones that we've already gotten. I think it was like if you got the digital deluxe version, you got hats like this or similar to that. But I mean, they look nicer. And then we have this one. Look how cute this is. She's just playing with the little bears. And then we got Yarny. She's thinking about. Wait a sec. Is this a hint to babies? That's not a toddler, right? Like that's a baby in a onesie. I mean, I guess you could put a, a child, I mean a toddler in a onesie, but I mean, that looks very much like a baby to me. Just saying, oh, wait, these potted plant, are those, hmm, I don't, I don't recall those before, but those are cute. Are those new? <laughs> I honestly don't even know anymore in The Sims. I feel like there's so much stuff, uh, but uh, yeah, got them rocking chairs as well. And then lastly, we have this screenshot. So she's just getting ready to sell her stuff on the Sims version of Etsy, which I think is really cool. I'm also curious, now that we're gonna have Plopsy, if you're able to sell like the stuff that you make in eco lifestyle, like the furniture and stuff, if you could sell it on here as well or any other things that you're able to make, that's what I'm kind of interested to know. So yeah, I think that's pretty much it as far as this kind of overview goes. I would say overall, I am excited for the pack, but I know that Create a Sim doesn't seem to be my favorite part of it because there's things again that I mentioned earlier that made it into the pack that looks similar to stuff that we already have. So, I mean, I'm not entirely looking forward to cast, which is usually what I look forward to in any stuff pack, but build by seems promising. And then again, knitting just seems like something that is just like another thing for your Sims to do. Will I be using it a lot? I don't know. It's really hard. I feel like I don't use a lot of the features that come with packs just from my own personal gameplay and stuff that I've noticed. But uh, I think Plopsy is kind of interesting. Again, don't know how much I'll use it. I just, I feel like the main thing that I use when it comes to Sims for is probably build and buy because uh, I use a lot of CC as far as create a sim and everything but recently I'm trying to use more of like the stuff that comes with packs so I guess uh, we'll see once the pack comes out and we'll see what people think about it uh, but definitely let me know in the comments what you guys think do you guys think this is gonna be like the next best stuff pack like do you guys think it'll be at the same tier as laundry day was because laundry day is still my favorite stuff pack it was our first community one and um uh, Honestly, I don't know. I feel like this doesn't meet the same level as that, but I'm still interested to see uh, everything about it. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and go. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll talk to you guys in a new video very soon. Bye guys.